<laughs> so, okay. It's uh, nine minutes to nine. 14 and a half million people tuned into Strictly Come Dancing this weekend, a record for the dance competition. Matt Baker, Pamela Stevenson and Cara Toynton waltz and rumbled and jive their way to the final on Saturday night. Did any number of things. It was uh, too close to call for the bookies. But in the end, Cara Toynton and her dance partner Artem Jigvintsev took the crown. No surprise, there were of course a few tears from both of them actually. Cara and Artem both dried their eyes now. Hello <laughs> with us. Good morning. Just a good Hi. morning. Yes. Emotions under control. Absolutely. Wow. Although, yes, a little you're, bit. You're carrying an injury. I know. Aren't you? Could you just yeah. show us where is it? Yeah, it's just the arm won't move at the moment. No, it's um, I tried something a little bit silly on Saturday, and it was a shame because the last two dances were a bit um, of a disaster. But we made it through, and to win it was just what was insane. the thing you did that was a little bit silly? I tried to do a backflip that I haven't actually done since I was about 11. So <laughs> I saw Matt do all those amazing tricks and he makes them look so easy. But the ground is a bit, um, the floor is a bit hard. Mm. So I shouldn't have done that. But all right, we'll chat more in a moment. First, uh, let's give people a reminder of how you became the winners. <laughs> You got Chris here to talk to you. When you put your hand up like that, Artem, is that what's that? What is that? Is that because you think you're what? I don't know. It's just a natural reaction, I guess. Okay. Hopefully, I'm not crying. Try to hide myself <laughs> from the camera, you know. <laughs> we know we've done enough tears already that night. But... Yeah. And yeah. Chris, you were sitting with Cara's parents. Cara's parents. Weren't you? Yeah, I was getting all the run down. Oh, she's been so busy <laughs> and this. Um, but there were two <laughs> things that stood out. One, your outfit for your um, show dance that you kept going. Mum, what do you think? What do you think, Mum? <laughs> And she's going, yeah, get on with it. And then, uh, then the drama of your your really sore wrist and the, uh, sort of the chat going, I think she's going to be all right. She... <laughs> really? It's very really dramatic, exciting, actually. Yeah. They must have been incredibly nervous. How do you talk? I mean, yeah. you must have talked to them throughout the competition. What, yeah. What... Well, I, actually, I've been living with them because I'm, I'm at the moment, and uh, I think it was a bit. It's a bit like being back at school, isn't it, Chris? And you've done it as well, Bill. Yeah, so yeah. you know not, what it's not like. Not quite as long as. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's one of those things that you've been working for so long that when you do win it, it's so emotional. I didn't quite expect. I think it's a one-off in a lifetime experience, and we'll never forget it. Mm. Uh, for you, what was the, the, the obviously apart from the winning, what was your your high point though from the from the final? Which bits did you enjoy oh, most? Dear. I think um, just completing the show dance, although so. we're a bit yeah. out of time. <laughs> <laughs> and I nearly got lost. I couldn't see the stairs. But um, I think probably the rumba yeah. and uh, getting Rumble's through four beautiful. dances was yeah, kind yeah. of quite a big thing. Artem, did you know that Cara had hurt her arm during oh, the dance? Oh, yes, I did. What did yeah. she say to you? Well, she actually kept it quiet. And then as soon as we were done with it, she's like, I think I broke my arm. <laughs> and I <laughs> looked at the arm first thing, like, no, I think you didn't break. I think you're okay. <laughs> Like, no, it really hurts. And, I mean, you could see because it was so swollen. Yeah. Yeah. And I was like, I don't know if we're going to be able to go and continue. So. I, was, I wasn't so much worried about I was worried about your buttons because they all seem to pop every time we're in the dance floor. <laughs> do, you actually put, do they ever put any buttons on your shirts when you're not doing really. something that's not... They're awards. probably trying not to. I don't know why, <laughs> but they're trying not to. <laughs> I just noticed you were, you were touching Cara's arm so gently. You're an item now, aren't you, the two of you? You are. Well, it's, sure. um, it's, we've, we've got on like a house on fire all the way through, which is quite a, a big achievement in itself because it's intense and you do have low moments. But um, now we've, we're, we're out of the studio, so it would be nice to do some normal things and 
maybe go to the cinema or to the shop. What, proper date things. things. Proper, proper date things. things. Yeah. I yeah. know, we've got to know each other so well. It's a bit of an odd situation, but yeah. through a different we, way. We, yeah. Just to take you back a, a little bit, we do have a, a small clip of the moment you first met. Oh. <laughs> There you are. Oh, look. Yeah, I'm look. hot under the collar already. Watch. Yeah. But also, we put it in slow-mo because oh, we slow wanted to catch something there. Is it coming up? No. Oh, OK, we thought we'd better give you it a can, look. I think you can possibly tell there was something mm. brewing there. Yeah. Well, because Artem was one of the new boys, yeah. I'm such an avid fan of the show. And so I didn't know what to expect. I know all the others very well, but I mm -hmm. didn't know this one. Mm. <laughs> so I was going to get to know him. Yeah, because yeah. I, th I thought, and everybody thought, you were going to get James Jordan. I know. Yes. And James Why? Is, well, because they're, they're the same height. James is... Oh, okay. Because you used to come and watch the show, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, so I'm, I'm the biggest Strictly fan. I was in the, the audience nearly every week. They had to get rid of me at one point, you know, let other people come. But, um, and I, I get on so well with James, so I kind of uh, thought I'd be paired with him. Yeah. And, uh, what did you, uh, there was a slight <laughs> kind of, well, I, there a lot of boos, weren't there, uh, for your marking for the, for the last dance? Cause who's, American um, Smooth. Yeah, because yeah. you, um, who's it gave you? Len. Len gave Len you seven. Seven, yeah. Seven. For what was an exquisite dance, because of some pernickety, itty bitty <laughs> oh, well, thing. What was it? There is always a. Uh, Your feet weren't on the floor or something. No, everything actually, the feet was on the floor because we were allowed to do lifts in American Smooth. The problem is, was enough of the Fox Shot content in it and close hold. Oh. So, which is. Which is the rule, and in the beginning, I actually wasn't aware of it 100%. It's so, the final. Um, Who wants rules in a final? Exactly. Who wants yeah, rules? Right. I mean, I think there should be a strictly rule book because it all gets a bit. Because we kind of, well, Artem is an amazing choreographer, and he thought American Smooth was kind of freestyle, but who knows? There should be a book. Did maybe. you say you were living with your parents? At the moment, yeah. I'm See, that same my... thing happened to me. Maybe that's the winning thing, because I moved out of my flat and I had to move me... back with my pets. See, and they are brilliant because they make you lovely food. <laughs> and did your dad choose the music for the rumba? For the rumba, yes. he chose the music for the rumba. It was really like going back in time, going to right. training was like let's school. Have, let's have a, a reminder of what the rumba... The rumba. One of them dances. <laughs> Dresses. I know, oh, that's dresses. what I'm going to miss the most, yes. is the being yeah. dressed up like a princess. Yeah. So I have to ask Chris how painful it was, having been there, to give away the glitter ball. It was heartbreaking. I mean, we, we never got to do our last champion's dance, so I thought I was going to get one more, which oh, was very upsetting. Wow. But then I saw the final and I thought, thank goodness for that, because they were so good. <laughs> what would you have done? I would, we were probably, I can only do one dance, so I'd have probably ended up doing the Charleston again. I but we never got a chance to do that. And then suddenly I saw people trampolining and you flying around. <laughs> I was thinking, I'm so glad I'm sat here, because I'm what, about a stone heavier. Well, that's what made this, what, what made the final so special this year, I thought, was any one of the final three couples oh. were, would have been a worthy champion, I thought, didn't Absolutely. you? Absolutely. I mean, we, we honestly thought we were goners because every week yeah. we tried to keep at the top of the leaderboard because then you get a chance to mm. stay longer. But when it came to the public vote, we never thought in a million years against Pamela, who's a complete inspiration and a bit of a machine. She blows me away. Mm. And... Um, Matt is just incredible from words go. So, yeah, we didn't expect it. And it's kind of, yeah, one-off bit of a dream, really. Yeah. And we're very proud. Meanwhile, you're not going to be dancing, presumably, for quite some time with your... With your is it a yeah, torn I ligament or what is just it? Just the t torn ligaments in the lower arm. Right. So I'm hoping that it will move soon. Could they, what can they do? Can they, can they strap it up? So you, the thing is not to move it, is it? Or? Just to, well, it's to try, I don't really know. What's what happens is that if you move, it's not really healing much because you, can, you keep irritating it. So it's yeah. good yeah. not to move, just... but at the same time, you can keep it always yeah. still. No, you do have to have some movement. You have to have some movement. Yeah. 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 You're going to have to have a servant. Yeah. <laughs> I actually had a uh, torn rotator cuff before, so I kind of know how it feels. It's really painful. 
Yeah. And you're spending yeah. Christmas together? Yes. Are you? Been, yeah, my family, so it'll be lovely. So oh. lots of time to go to the cinema. Yes, Here you go. all the normal sort of nice things. Excellent. Oh, wait. Good I luck. like how you're staring away there, Shana. No, like, no, no, you no. must look after me. <laughs> just, just, uh, just ask him. Just see. collapse the next day, him. Chris. Did you? It's weird, isn't it? That last. That I day was after. actually on breakfast a day oh, later. Yeah. So I was up at 4.30 back here oh, with right. the trove, but yeah, yeah, it's a bit weird. I mean, obviously, <laughs> you're spending more time together, but it was like completely separate. Ola went off to see James and I yeah. went back to my own life, which was a bit strange, I've got to say. Yeah, oh. absolutely. But you'll get to dance again. Yes, in the tour. So It'll be lovely. good. Yeah. Yeah. Well, congratulations. Well done. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. And if you missed any of last night's episode, you can watch it back on BBC iPlayer as many times as you like. They are a lovely couple as well. <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> uh, in a moment, another winner. This year's Apprentice winner, it's Stella English. First, let's have a last quick look at what